following the terrorist attack on Propast, where eight I officers and five civilians were killed by Marxist party members. The Syndicate has promised to maintain heightened security across Europolis until after the upcoming elections. The Propast district remains under full I lockdown and 24-hour curfew. We're now joined by Marek Farah in Propast. And Marek, how are regular people in Propast handling this very difficult situation? Well, Rika, as you can see, the streets here are deserted. Almost two months after the August attack on the I headquarters in Propast. There's security everywhere, and everyone who goes outside is subject to random searches and arrests. There is a 24-hour curfew in effect, but people are allowed to traverse the district as long as they carry the appropriate paperwork and submit to any searches and questions. What about essential... The eggs like aren't quite done yet. Are any stores or restaurants still open? I think this is Everything done. Everything is closed, mm, Rika, good. but rations are distributed to residents of Propast on a regular basis, and medical personnel are on constant standby. No one here is in any immediate danger of starvation. Has there been any indication of how long this lockdown will continue? The Syndicate is not saying, Rika, but spokespeople have hinted that Propast will remain under Syndicate guardianship until after the election in... We appear to have lost our connection to Marek Farah in Propast. We will attempt to re-establish the connection. In the meantime, when Eat we come standing back, we up, talk to like an animal. very close to Marxist <laughs> it hasn't come to that and terrorist mastermind yet. Marta Rebus about her dark and... Shit. Power's out. Again. I'm sure they're doing this just to screw with us. I'll have to check the emergency fuel cell in the kitchen cabinet. It should have kicked in by now. I can jiggle it a bit. That sometimes works. Nope, that did not work. I guess I need a new one. And I know just the person. Zoe Maya Castillo, your district is subject to syndicate mandated martial law. Please submit an approved destination or return to your home. Thank you. The pandemonium is your only approved destination. I will accompany you. Please, don't talk. We are authorized to use deadly force against any perceived threat. Stay close to your escort and don't deviate from your path. We're not fucking around anymore. We should teach you. Everything's closed. No customers, no permits. Everything's closed. No customers, no permits. I don't miss Look working what the for bot Mira, tracked in. Maybe it's all. something I, I don't ate, miss it. But I actually feel but relieved I will miss to her see when you she She's added you spice right? to my hum. I'm really not. You? You know, Wit is not exactly vivacious company. It's been quiet around here since we closed shop. I apologize for firing you with a pre recorded message, by the way. Company policy. Oh, don't worry about it. You said you closed shop. There's no business. We don't even have wire access. It's like being on a really shitty desert island without sun, sand or coconuts. Or wire access. We're actually thinking about heading back to Mumbai. Well, I'm thinking about it. We will tag along wherever the road takes us. Anyway, you're here for your dreamer. 
What? I fixed it. You had your dream machine delivered to me. Because it was broken? About a month ago? Does any of this ring a bell? Your friend, that German suit, said you'd come by to pick it up? He looked like a Jaeger. I thought he was here to blow my brains out, but he was very personable. What was wrong with it? An early batch. Bad soldering. I fixed several like it in the past. FYI, it's an off-the-shelf model that pings Wati servers with a device ID and your biometric data as soon as you connect. That won't be a problem unless they've put an alert out on you or that particular device. But I went ahead and blocked it anyway. Still, it is a licensed product. There may be other security measures. I cannot be 100% sure that it won't alert Wati. There are unlicensed dreamers out there without any security chips. But Mr. London has that market locked up here in Propast. Given the trigger-happy toy soldiers out there, I wouldn't know how to get hold of one. I'll be fine with this one. As long as you know the risks. If you weren't here for that, then why the house call? Oh, uh, fuel cell. The power went out and I don't have a working backup. That's not very smart, Kutia. Lucky for you, I'm up to my neck in fuel cells. Anything particular you're in the market for? The cheapest you have. Grab one from that box over there. They're refurbished cells, but they'll keep your apartment going for a few weeks at least. Bring it back before it goes dead. I'll refill it for you. So how much do I owe you? Consider it your severance package. If we're ever back in business, there will be a job for you. You're not too bad, Kurtia. Despite appearances. Uh, thanks, I guess. Wait, what happened to that data I decrypted for you? Who did you end up giving it to? I gave it to the Hand, but before they could publish it... They were shut down. Where's the data now? With Reza, in Iceland. Iceland. The final refuge of rogue journalists. You didn't keep a copy? I didn't want to risk it. Stupid, I know. You may have just saved your ass. Too bad about the story, though. When is your Jorbo coming back? I really don't know. When they feel it's safe, I guess. That story needs to run, Kutria. Whatever it takes, make it happen. You have expended your daily time out. I will now accompany you back to your registered domicile. Don't bother, I know the way. Every step you take, I'll be watching you, as mandated by martial law. How about every breath I... Oh, I give up. Miss Castillo? Queenie is requesting your immediate audience. Sure, but uh, what about my, uh, my escort? You have arrived at your approved location. Have a nice day. You can come on board now. Impressive. We do our best. I'm glad you're back on your feet, Zoe. I was hoping to see you again before I left. You're leaving? I heard the hand was shut down. You had friends there. Good friends. The hand was going to publish an article about Watticorp conspiring with both Unity and European Dawn when the Syndicate shut them down. But they still have the evidence. My ex-boyfriend Reza brought it to Iceland. The data's safe there, but the hand hasn't been able to publish it. There's still a chance to make things right then. This is why I wanted to speak with you. You knew the woman who set off the bomb. Nella. You were there. I tried to stop her, but it was too late. I don't believe she planned to kill anyone. She wasn't... Nella was a good person. She cared about people. 
She gave me something to keep safe, but I lost it in the explosion. Maybe it could have explained why... Our lives are shaped by events beyond our control. The choices we make can point us down one road or the other. But where that road ultimately leads... Your friend's death was not of her own making. The device she used was rigged. It was meant to disrupt the eye, not to kill anyone. An EMP? How do you know this? Nela needed someone to help her assemble the device. Hannah came to me after the bombing. She was distraught. Of course, she had no idea what they were doing. But she is the link. She may be able to connect the bomb to the Syndicate. The Syndicate is behind the attack on their own people. Everyone is expendable. It all leads back to what he called Zoe. They are consolidating their power and ridding themselves of loose threads. I'm leaving. This city is infected, rotting from the inside. You need to leave too, but first, there's something you must do. Your memories, they're coming back. I know what I need to do. The dream machine. Be very careful. Powerful forces are converging here and elsewhere. How do you... I've been around a long time. You learn to read the signs. You're fading, Zoe. Fading. Like a page that's been left out in the sun too long. Do what needs to be done. Do not hesitate any longer. I've given you time to regain your resolve, but we're almost out of it now. If we both make it through the storm ahead, I'll find you again. I hope so. I will. Now go home and do what needs to be done. Wake up! You can come out now. How long have you known I was here? Do not mistake me for an old woman, Hana. You told her about... There's no more time for secrets. Watikorp must be brought down. What you know will make a difference. But I don't have any actual proof they were involved. I only made deliveries. You know enough. Find the evidence. Work together with Zoe. How do you know we can trust her? She's like you. Someone who shapes dreams. I know. I mean, I guess when we met. But how is that even possible? I thought I was the only one. Why do you think you were drawn together? Coincidence is a powerful force. Zoe needs your help. A terrible shadow has fallen over her. How do you know this? I don't. I'm not a fortune teller, and the future is never crystal clear. It branches and divides, indefinitely and infinitely, but there are patterns and signs. If you know where to look, do you have to leave? They know I'm here now. Watikorp has been looking for me a long time. I'm a... a loose thread. I promise I'll find you again, Hannah. Your journey is just beginning. There are wonderful things in store for you. But for now, your job is to help Zoe finish her journey. Without that, Without her, there will be no more stories. Afterwards, if the universe is still here, we can talk about the next chapter.
For the life of me, I can't remember asking Mira to fix this. Am I losing my mind? I mean, I was in the hospital for severe trauma, and that's after spending a year in a coma. I never knew my mother, but I've been told that in many ways she's the opposite of my father. Gabrielle never makes hasty choices. Gabrielle ponders, and when his mind's made up, he'll stick with his decision until the end. My mother's impulsive, mercurial. If the wind changes, she'll let herself be swept away with it, as long as it's to her benefit. She put me in a coma. I'm not a big fan. But maybe it's time I accept some risks. After all, I keep telling everyone I want to remember. I need to enter dream time. I need to revisit the past. It's the only way to save the future. You returned, but you were still not here. You must be here. Is this a dream? I thought I'd actually travel across this time. You were here, but never truly. Not yet. But you must come to... Ah! What the heck was that? Oh, hey guys, what's up? Crow? You're Crow. You're Crow. I remember you. You do? I am. Wait. I remember you too. Of course you do. It's me. Don't Zoe. say anything. I've got this. Lorelei. Baby Cakes. Schnoodlebum. Who? I'm... Agneta. I'm sorry. Uh, how have you been? That's not... Look, Aggie, I apologize for taking off without a word of warning. I didn't have a choice. I was needed. I'm not Agnita. I'm... Auntie May? No. Zoe. Where? Oh. Oh, Zoe! Yes! 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 The girl who was dreaming. You look... different. Are you sure you're you? <laughs> Pretty sure. I don't know. You look a lot better than you used to, and your voice, it's sultry. You sound like a cinnamon bird. I don't even know what that means. I was in a coma for a while, maybe that's... What are you doing here, Crow? Are you really here? Let me check. Yep, all here, not a feather missing. So, where is here exactly? Whoa, Nelly, I didn't expect that. Uh, you. Uh, you're. memorable. Wait. Auntie May? No? No. I was Abnaxus of the Venar. That's right. I remember you now. You were really annoying to talk to. Took ages to get anywhere. How have you been? I will not complain. I don't get it. This is just like that dream I've been having. Except for you, Crow. You're new. And improved. It's that preening routine I'm following. I'm telling you, it's a game changer. So why didn't I make it across? The connection was weak. Compromised. You were only half dreaming. Only half there. You will need to be all there. And soon, or it was too late, but you had brought the bird over. The bird will be the key. If you can just...
The hallway is... <coughs> ...is clear. You must leave, now. They are coming. <coughs> what can I do to... Schnell, Fräulein! Zoe! Over here, quickly! This way. Where are we going? We need to get off the streets. Did Queenie send you? She said that you needed help. Why did you tell Queenie I wasn't doing so well? You weren't. That's not the point. I said I was fine. It wasn't up for interpretation. Sometimes it's better to just let people know rather than keep pretending. The eyes will be here soon. We need to go underground. How's that gonna help? We can't just hole up in one of those chambers forever. Trust me. What is this place? The world beneath. A network of tunnels covering all of Pro Past and beyond. I don't know how far it goes. This is amazing. Is this how you guys get around? For the most part. Some of the nests are only accessible from above ground, but you can get pretty much anywhere from here. Come on. Wait, where are we going? You spoke with Queenie. You know I helped Nella with that... device. The one that killed all those people. You didn't know. And neither did Nella. You're right. But someone did. Someone does, and we're gonna put it right. Mr. London has a warehouse down here. It's where I pick up and make deliveries. It was just a job, but... That's where we're going. To find evidence to connect Wattie Corp to the bombing. This warehouse, is that where London keeps his unlicensed dream machines? He keeps everything in there. Why? I need one. For after we clear Nella's name. Long story. Tell me later. We need to go. It's only a matter of time before the eyes start digging deeper. I came as fast as I could. Are you okay? Perfectly. You know Zoe. Hey Zoe. This is yours. You dropped it when... Boom. I was following you. I didn't know who you were working for back then. I saw what happened. The man who pulled you away, he didn't notice you dropping that. I thought the eye took it. I've been wanting to return it. What is it? I don't know. Maybe nothing. Let's get a move on before the eyes figure out where we are. We lost power to the gates. They must know you're down here. We'll have to use the manual overrides. It requires two people, some sort of security measure. I'll show you how it works. Go ahead, Abby. Okay, Zoe, you can pass through now. After this is over, can we please leave Propast and go somewhere that has an actual sun? And no battle suits. I promise. You're not coming with us. I'm going to make sure you have time to do what you need to do. She'll take care of the eyes. Is that safe? Don't worry about me. I've done this before, plenty of times. See you soon, babe. Be careful. Always am. Hannah, I- Stop. Love you. Me too. I'm happy to see you guys are okay. What you said to Abby... It made a difference. She stopped using the dream machine. And after you found me, I realized I couldn't just... keep hiding. I promised Abby we'd get out of Europolis. I'm thinking Mumbai. Why Mumbai? Don't laugh, but... I had a dream about it. About those dreams? Visions. They are more like visions, right? Or like peeking through a curtain, across a, a, a divide. There's another world there. I've seen it. Have you been there? I have. And you dream yourself across? I can, but only by connecting to a dream machine. I thought I was the only one. Me too. 
What does that mean? I don't know. But we'll find out. Together. Okay, so you know the drill. Once the gate opens, you need to go through and hold the lever down. Push it down. All right, I'm coming through. Don't let go or I'll be sliced ham. So what happened? Nailer, the device? The detonator was supposed to trigger an electromagnetic burst. You know, to disrupt communications and mess with the eye battle suits. But the EMP generator got switched out with an antimatter chamber. Jesus. Lucky for you, it had limited range. They weren't trying to wipe Caprova off the map. I guess they just wanted to make a point. Frame manifesto. Let's do this. Same as last... Do you hear that beeping? What is that? I don't... Yeah, it's coming from you. You're beeping. Why would this be so important to Nella? It makes no sense. It's beeping. What is this? Some sort of holographic storage? I don't know, but it's reacting to something down here. Let's track it down. Come on, follow me. Frame manifesto. Remove another party from the election. And shut down the city. Full curfew, everyone stays at home, hooked up to their dream machines. What he wins. So where did the antimatter come from? London's a stickler for detail. He'd always make sure everything that moved in and out of his warehouse is scanned and catalogued. Paranoia, maybe? Covering his ass. Anyway, when I picked up that final piece, the one that was supposed to be an EMP generator, I noticed it had a Watty Corp reference code in their system. I didn't think much about it. I mean, they make everything else, so why not? If we can find one of those antimatter chambers, along with the tracking information... We may be able to connect Watty Corp with the device. We can prove they were behind the attack. And the whole house of cards comes tumbling down. Or maybe we get killed. I'd say our odds are 50-50. I think this is it. Um... What is this? It's a... a singularity, I think. One of the original wire access points from before the collapse. That's pretty cool. It must have fallen off the grid. Let me check if it's... It's active. So the Syndicate has no idea this exists. But I can't establish a connection to my iris. Or protocols, probably. It has a holographic port. It might be able to read physical data, and it's blinking at the same rate Nella's package is beeping. It's like it wants to connect. I guess we should do what it asks. It's an old hardwire access point. Nella Vilcek, owner of Nella Bytes. I'm leaving this message. Manifesto party leadership has not authorized its operation. Marta Ribas has no knowledge of what's about to happen. I'm acting of my own free will as part of a manifesto splinter group. We're tired of... <sighs> Marta Rivas believes in politics. She's an idealist. I wish more people were like her. But the truth is... Democracy is dead. The corporates won. The elections are a facade. It's all a big, fat festering lie, a show put on by our syndicate puppet masters to appease the proletariat. Whoever wins this autumn, it won't change a goddamn thing. They have made sure of that. They own them all. Everyone's corrupted. Everyone. We can't let this go on. We need to shake things up, start fresh. This is why... This is why I'm taking action today. I have been asked to detonate a non-lethal EMP charge in front of the I headquarters on Kaprova. 
This custom-built charge was designed to disable eye communications, sabotage their operations, and immobilize their battle suits. It's a... a... message. A loud, bold message, but... <sighs> it's just another lie. The non-lethal EMP charge has been replaced with a very lethal antimatter device. The detonation will kill me, along with anyone else caught in the blast. There will be casualties. Military and... and civilian. They'll accuse Ribas of harboring radicals and inciting violence. Manifesto will be destroyed. They don't know that I know. If they did, I'd be dead. But... I need to go through with this. Because if I don't... Nothing changes. If I go to the authorities or the press, they'll sweep it all under the rug and make me disappear. They're good at that. If I carry out their plans, however, everyone pays attention. They'll have no choice. And then afterwards? Expose the cunts. The ones pulling the strings. The ones who built the fucking bomb. What a corp. I'll be a terrorist and a murderer, but so will they, and they have a lot more to lose. Lucky for me, they've been arrogant and sloppy, that's how I found out, and they've left evidence for someone to... E-N-N-I-N-G. Penning. The chamber was swapped out before I could... And track this part back to Watikorp. Decrypt this message with a dead drop signal embedded in the local hardwire, which will be triggered the moment my iris goes dark. I'll have to trust that the right people will follow the right signals down into the underground. I'm... I'm truly sorry that people are going to get hurt. Killed. I wish there was some other way. I just don't know what I can... Jesus. I can't believe Nella did what she did. The people she hurt, killed. I can't tell Hannah the truth. She'll just blame herself. We have to get Watty for this, or those people will have died in vain. Most of it was garbage.